Please note that this video has spoilers for the subject. Put off by how long this video is. Don't worry, I try to jam pack my videos with as much content and as much detail as I possibly can. Anything I feel I can comment on and that I feel you might be interested in, I pretty much put in the video. I try not to repeat myself and talk fairly fast. Robin Hood, The Prince of Thieves, movie thoughts. The... I, I quite like the element that King Richard stops the wedding to bless it. And the... You know, in spite of it not being Michael Wincott who gets to fight Robin when, you know, there are versions where it is Guy of Gisborne who does so rather than the sheriff. Yeah, he's, he's still, excuse me, a lot of fun in the film, excuse me, and it's, yeah. Now, the... I thought that... Maybe it's just me, but I noticed that in the climax, several of the bad guy characters are seen, like, drooling. Like, I think one of them was the executioner, and... You know, the sheriff had at least one shot where he was, like, drooling, like, what is this, alien? It's, yeah. And I, I do quite like Friar Tuck's, you know, killing of the, the bishop, you know, weighing him down with treasure and defenestrating him. You know, he just needs to be Puma Man, that's really all. And... Yeah, the, the mention of, you know, 30 pieces of silver is, is quite good. I very much enjoyed Freeman in the action scenes, that he really gets to, you know, use that nice, you know, I, I don't remember what, the, is it a scimitar or, yeah, just the, the sword. Yeah, and that, you know, the, you know, the, the various women get to, you know, kick at least some ass that, you know, the, I forget her name, Sarah maybe, but yeah, the, the Maid Marian's handmaiden that, you know, she, you know, gives one of the Mary men a black eye. I, I'm not sure if it was the, the, the bull or if it was much miller but one of them at least I'm, I'm pretty sure and you know marion actually you know she she turns out to be fairly you know evenly matched with robin in that first scene and you know the you know, she says, you know, she just remembers him as the sport bully who would burn her hair. But now he has moved on to her hand. And, yeah, the, the, you know, I'm, I'm, I quite like the scenes where Robin is bested in one way or another that he's not you know that that is very true to the legends that he doesn't always necessarily win you know sometimes he's the one who gets bested by by someone else you know the the various elements in the the staff fight with little john are are quite nice the you know the occasional dirty tricks of Little John and when Robin fakes, you know, having drowned, having disappeared into the water and then actually, you know, yeah, pulling Little John in and, you know, showing that there was, there was plenty of room down, you know, that it wasn't very far to the bottom, so it wasn't a problem for him to lie there in wait for John. And 
I do think that it's one of the subplots that probably should have been cut overall, but I do like that they did give Will Scarlet something to do in this that, you know, his his hatred of Robin and the the various elements there that, that Wolf believes that he will actually try to kill Robin and then when Wolf sees him on you know the day of the, the hangings and the wedding that you know he genuinely thinks that Will actually tried to kill Robin and then they have to actually you know they they have to think of something new on the spot because suddenly they're you know he's being placed to have his head chopped off on the barrel of gunpowder so yeah that's you know and and leave it to the 90s action movies to figure out a way to get explosions into a story set in 1194 you know i i don't i'm not sure if it's anachronistic or if actually you know but yeah nevertheless you know the before this movie i'm not sure you would really have connected explosions with robin hood and the yeah i suppose that might more or less be it i like how feisty friar tuck is and also very true to the legend and the the all the stuff where you know azim is you know showing that he has some better technology and he you know yeah where where he is equal to or sometimes at, you know in parts better than christians is you know i appreciate the you know like like i said in the review i'm very liberal so i very much agree that you know muslims are are equals you know we should we shouldn't racially profile sam harris and we should actually you know we shouldn't be suspicious of them you know bill maher likes to forget that right wingers radical right wingers are very dangerous and very eager to bomb as well anyway I do think that overall it's a, maybe a bit forced. It's you know, yeah, it's it's trying to fix this thing of you know because the story very much the 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 Crusades are an inherent part of the the legends it, that. Robin Hood was necessary while King Richard was off fighting the Crusades. So to try to address that, you know, was, was deemed necessary. And I do also, you know, I, I haven't watched the British TV series from 1984, but I realized that this wasn't the first, you know, filmed version to have a Muslim character in this legend. I've read other parts of this franchise, the links are in the description box. Please comment, thumbs up, and subscribe for more content.